All right, episode five in the three on three Diamond League tournament for twenty thousand dollars. So far, the green bean bars have had great success. We have been on track to win the twenty thousand dollars, but this game might be where the series will take a dark turn. This game, we'll play a team called Arvada West, and we have our worst shooting game that we've had all season. These guys have lost all their games, but they go off in this one. We have won all our games so far, so this is the first time we faced real adversity. Our teammates actually end up fighting, so without further ado, let's get into it. All right, so to start off the game, we have our team captain to the ball. He makes a scoop layup to give us a lead. Next play, number 23, ties the game up with a nice cut. Okay, so now we got CV driving with three people. He missed the layup. He's too off to pass, but he shoots it instead. He misses that too. Now for this play, I'm sorry you can't see the one in the corner, but it ends with number 22 getting a wide open jump shot, giving Arvado West the lead. Now we got Eli driving in. He kicks it to Max. Max goes up, but he missed the layup. He gets his own rebound. And he makes the layup. So now it's number four of the ball. He drives in and he kicks his cutting teammate number 23 for the layup. That's my bad. Then after that, number 21 gets the layup off a loose ball. This game, I just want to say, he does a lot of damage to us. So now Eli's driving in. He gets it to our big man. Max is going to go up. He's too big. So now number 55 is going to go up for a layup. Get that out of here. I run the paint. Now Eli drives and he's out to me. I have an open three, but I break the three-pointer. But I never said I run the three-point line. I run the paint. So next play, I have the ball. I drive in, and you can see here, he just slaps me. The ref doesn't call it. It was an obvious foul. And that is one point taken away from us. Here, I throw the ball to CV. Steve's going to drive in. He kicks out to me. I drive back in for the layup, and I tie up this game. So here on Votto West was a pick and roll. Number 21 gets a wide open jump shot off it, and it goes in. Look at how Steve just bumps me back on that jump shot. So now I have the ball. I have three-point line. Number 21's pressing up. I blow by him, and I get the finger roll layup on the left side. The game is all tied up again. It's neck and neck right now. So here Steve kicks the ball to me. I pull a three, but this game, I just want to say I am a brick. Number 23 gets it at the three-point line, and he is cash. So now Arvada West has a two-point lead, but not if Steve has anything to say about it. He drains a step back three. He banks it in. He ties this game up. And now 21 has the ball. He blows through his door, and he makes the layup. But Max is going to respond. He's going to go in all the way for the layup. This game is tied up again. No one can seem to get a lead. So here, number 21 gets another layup on us. But now I have the ball. I'm going to drive in for the layup. I make it. We are trading blows at this point. So now I do a spin move on number four, and I go for the layup, but I brick off the backboard, and then it goes flying out of bounds. So now 55 is going to try and pull a stepping on me. Get that weak stuff out of here. So now, after I swat number 55, he's going to try his luck again, but his luck isn't any different. Max gets a swat on him this time. So now 23 blows Max's doors, and he makes a tough layup over him. We don't seem to have an answer for these guys at the moment. So now I give the ball to Lucas. Lucas is dribbling the ball back and forth. He's on the baseline. He tries to give it to me. <laughs> but he ends up throwing the ball right into number 23's ball. Now I have the ball again. I'm going to try and take it in and do a behind-the-back move. But I lose it. 22 gets the loose ball. He's going to pull a step back on Max. Bang! Our bottle West has a three-point lead on us. Eli blows by number 55. Next play for the layup, making it a two-point game. 
He let go of layup last play. Now he's going to try and pull for three, but it's a break. See if he gets the rebound. You can't see him, but he's going to pull the corner three. Bang! He ties this game back up. This play, I drive in, but then I kick it out to Eli when it kind of get grabbed by 55. He has to drive in for the layup. He trips over his own feet, but he gives us the lead with that layup. So you can't see what goes on, but they end up hitting a three-pointer in the corner from number four. So yeah, and now 21 is going to go for a layup. He kicks it down to 23, and I'm oh so close to swatting him, but he just gets it off. They have a two-point lead now. This could be the game that ends our perfect record, but Max will not let that happen. He gets Lucas's missed shot and puts it back in. It's a one-point game. Number four now is the ball. He gives it to 21. 21 goes into the lamp. He kicks it out to number four. Number four drives in and gets it to number 23. He just drains a three-pointer in my eye. But look at how close here Max was to falling down. Max, you are lucky you did not fall down. So now, I'm going to pull up to the top of the key, but today wasn't my day for shooting threes. I get my rebound, I put it back up, and I can at least make that shot. It's a two-point game now. 23 now has the ball. He drives it on Lucas, but the lamp is off. Max gets the rebound. 23 pokes it away. I respect the hustle, but I get the ball after he saves it, and then I go for the layup. The green bean boys are back in it. So we finally call it to a one-point game, and Lucas just gives him a wide open three. Not something like that. You can see he's yelling at him because now they are pulling away. But there's no time to worry about that. I get the layup next play. Two-point game now. So at this point, the game is almost over. So we're playing tight D. Number 21 goes up for a layup. He misses it. 26 rebound. But he gets swatted by Max. Good stuff. And I get the ball. I fake a pass to Max. Give it to Lucas. Lucas is going to pull up our sharpshooter. It's a brick. But check out this swap for Max. We can't afford to give this game up. See if he has the ball. He pulls a step back, but it's a brick. He gets his own rebound. He's really hustling out here. And he gets the layup. We are back at a one-point game. So now, it is out with the ball. So he's going to pull another three-pointer. I get the rebound. I give it to Eli. Eli is dribbling with the ball. He goes into me. There's barely any time left. We really want to get a bucket this possession. So I give the ball back to Eli. I then set him a screen. He's going to pull a contested three for some reason. I get the rebound, though. I'm going to drive in. You can see here, he just pushes me right in front of the ref, but he doesn't call it. Now number 21 has the ball. He gets it to number 22 from three. It's a brick, and we come down with the ball. Eli is going to throw up another three, and he breaks another three. It's their ball now. We need to get a stop in this play. But CV immediately gets his doors blown, and he gives it the layup. They're now up by two. I give the ball to CV. He bricks that three-pointer as well. Eli now has a chance to make it a one-point game and breathe a little bit of life back into our team. So now there are five seconds left on the clock. I go to Max. Max, to save our perfect record. He bricks it to end the game. And our perfect record is ruined. <laughs> So, we lost our first game of the season. Next, we play an undefeated team, and when you watch the video, you will see why. They're undefeated.